If you are tired of grey walls and white subway tiles in your bathroom, you are in the right place. In this video, we will discuss the bathroom color ideas for creating a rejuvenating sanctuary. We are going to go a bit into a psychology of color and we will talk about how different colors not only create a different atmosphere and mood, but uh, influence our emotions and states of mind. We will talk about which colors are the most suitable to create a feeling of relaxation and happiness, which is what you want in your home spa, and which colors are not good for the bathroom and why. Hi there, I'm Natalia Kalin, and I'm super excited to have you on my channel. I'm here to assist you in creating amazing environments that are not only visually appealing, but also have a positive impact on your well-being. Whether you want to feel healthy, vibrant, relaxed, productive, or just happy, your space can support you in this. So stick around, hit that subscribe button, because I've got lots of interesting and useful things to share with you. Okay, back to bathrooms. The bathroom is a very important room, you see. In this age of busyness and chronic stress, it's essential that we take good care of our body and mind. A bathroom is a place where we can relax and rejuvenate. And the bathroom color has a huge influence on not only how the room will look, but how we will feel there. Yes, that's right. We can choose how we want to feel. Different colors will create different experiences. If we know how we want to feel, we can influence it by introducing certain colors and avoiding other colors. If the environment is irresistibly beautiful, pleasing to our senses and relaxing, you would want to stay longer there and can relax deeper. In the last decade, the gray color was trending. The grays were used in every room where it made sense, but also grays were used in areas where it didn't make sense. In the bathroom, it totally didn't make sense. Trends are ever-changing, and while gray has had its moment, I hope you are ready for more colorful choices, especially for bathroom designs. Gray walls, especially in a combination with white subway tiles, create not only very boring, but also cold and even depressing environment. Also, our skin doesn't appear as healthy or vibrant against the gray background. This is a beautiful bathroom, but it is cold and unemotional and totally doesn't have to be gray and white. If you stick around toward the end, I will show them some other colors that totally do not work in bathrooms. This light blue is a little better. Research shows that blues are very calming to our nervous system. But this particular shade of blue is cold. It still doesn't feel like you want to spend time in this bathroom. It just feels cold to undress and take a shower and not uh, speaking about taking a long and rejuvenating bath. In a bathroom, we want warm color, not cold. I found that aqua or teal shades work very well. Over the years, it's been one of uh, the favorite bathroom colors of my clients and mine. Aqua has almost equal amount of blue and green, and it is relaxing for most people. It's perfect for creating a feeling of spa or sanctuary. It is beautiful and perhaps reminds us of uh, tropical vacations in Caribbean. Note how well it complements the light wood of vanity and light beige floor tiles. This is a powder room and uh, look how well this uh, darker shade of uh, aqua complements the floor tiles. Uh, they're certainly warm but looks like they may even have a little bit of blue in them. And I do like how uh, darker wood uh, vanity looks with the aqua and uh, certainly white quartz. This particular color is Palladian Blue by Benjamin Moore. Another beautiful aqua bathroom here. I love how my client combine warm gray walls with aqua tiles. 
definitely creative, unexpected, beautiful and warm bathroom where grey color is used but it is complemented with aqua color of the tiles. There is another one of my client's favorite teal bathroom color, Beach Glass, also from Benjamin Moore. This one has a little bit more grey in it and a little bit cooler, but with warmer wood can be quite a special color for your bathroom. As you can see, aqua or teal colors are pretty versatile and easy and a great fit to create that soothing and uh, beautiful vibe. And before we move on to our next color, what do you think about aqua bathroom? Can you see yourself relaxing in this space? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. The next bathroom color idea is a bit unusual. I certainly haven't seen much of it in uh, bathrooms, but I tried it in my uh, guest bathroom and I loved it. I picked it because it feels happy and also calming to the nervous system in a different kind of way. It's not for everyone, but if you feel uh, drawn to it, you will be happy with this choice. It is an earthy color with a touch of pink. It's warm, but not uh, overwhelmingly warm. Uh, and it looks good with the brown tiles and uh, gray tiles of the floor and uh, dark wood vanity. To lighten space up, I picked a silvery light curtain. Uh, it certainly feels like a right idea for this uh, bathroom. This particular one is Glamour from uh, Sherwin Williams. Here is another bathroom with a bit lighter mauve or grayish pink color. Feel how it brings a happy vibe to this bathroom. It looks good with whites and browns. Another favorite bathroom color is green. Green is not an easy color and only a few shades of green would work well in a bathroom. It has to be warm and light. Research indicates that people feel uh, relaxed and uplifted in green environment. After all, it is the color of nature and the light greens are associated with spring. See how nicely it complements the warm wood of this vanity. If you like the look, you can check out Benjamin Moore spring bud. This bathroom may feel a bit outdated probably because of the tiles, but what attracts me here is a particular warmth of this environment, which is a combination of this uh, beautiful light wood, very muted green of the walls and creamy color of tiles. Here is another warm green bathroom. This green is a bit more saturated. I personally feel more relaxed uh, with less saturated greens. This one is quite an active color, but it is an uplifting color and I know some people would thrive in it. It is definitely beautiful, warm and goes well with yellowish floors and art. Now I wanted to show a few colors that are not suitable in the bathroom. Can you guess what is the most outrageous bathroom color I've ever seen is? It is red. I don't know anyone who can relax in a bathroom like this. Red is a stimulant. It's overwhelming and even disturbing in a bathroom, a place where we feel especially sensitive. It certainly feels out of place here. Saturated yellow is another wrong color choice for a bathroom. It's very active color. It stimulates mental activity and in a big dose like this can create anxiety. For most people, it would be irritating. Pumpkin or orange color is not too bad, but also would not be my choice for a relaxing bathroom. It just feels a bit too heavy to me. Yellows can be uh, implemented in a bathroom, but uh, on a more muted side and in moderation. I really like how my client used this beautiful muted yellow trim with light green walls. The combination of yellow and green created a happy, sunny feeling in this bathroom. If you like certain saturated colors, it's a great opportunity to implement them in a powder room. Like this beautiful magenta makes an ordinary room pretty special. Or purple. 
Remember the dark room makes the room feel uh, smaller, so sometimes an accent wall is more appropriate than painting the entire room. An accent wall can become like a piece of art. And what if you just redid your bathroom and don't want to change your color and your tiles? Adding plants and warmer lights would help to soften the environment, especially if you have large tiled areas. Also, adding natural materials and colors like these mats and pots uh, will help a great deal. And of course, don't forget to bring some extras. Light a few candles, add some bath salts, maybe a few drops of essential oil, and you've transformed your bathroom into a spa. Time to treat yourself to a nice, long, rejuvenating showers and baths. I hope you've enjoyed our journey through bathroom colors. Let me know in the comments below which colors you loved, which ones you didn't, and uh, share any wild bathroom color stories you might have. Also, if you enjoyed the video, I'd appreciate it if you like, share, and subscribe. See you soon!